India to introduce new drug bill. In a parliamentary notice released on Thursday, India revealed its plan to introduce a new drug bill next week. The bill aims to establish regulations for import, manufacture and sale of medicine within the country. This move comes as India seeks to learn from a tragic incident involving a deadly cough syrup scandal. Last year, cough syrups produced in India were linked to the death of at least 89 children in Gambia and Uzbekistan. Aspartame declared as a possible carcinogen but deemed safe at current levels. Two groups associated with the WHO made important announcement on Friday regarding the artificial sweetener aspartame. They classified aspartame as a possible carcinogen, however, a separate WHO expert panel, the Joint FAO-WHO Expert Committee on Food Additives, conducted its comprehensive review and stated that there is no convincing evidence of harm caused by aspartame. JECFA recommended that the people continue to consume aspartame within the previously agreed-upon levels, which are below 40 mg per kg per day. This equates to approximately 9 to 14 cans of soda daily. India's GST Council grants exemption on rare disease drug. In a significant development on Tuesday, Nirmala Sitaraman, the Union Finance Minister, chaired the 50th GST Council meeting. During the session, several exemptions and new taxes were announced. Notably, the Council decided to exempt the Integrated Goods and Services Tax on the cancer drugs Dinutexumab when imported for personal use. Dinutexumab beta is a second-line treatment of neuroblastoma, a type of cancer affecting the nerve cells in patients over one year of age. Additionally, the GST Council also provided exemptions for medicines and food for special medical purpose used in the treatment of rare disease listed under the National Policy for Rare Disease 2021. These exemptions apply when imported for personal use subjected to existing conditions.